your project, the next step is you need to import your media. You need to import the clips that you're editing from. And how you import this will vary slightly depending on what you filmed them on. In this video, we're going to show you how to import them from an SD card. Nani from Nani Talks. Go check out her channel. Just search Nani Talks, N-A-N-N-I Talks. Or, um, but she uh, filmed this on her camera, which uses an SD card. So we're going to show you how to import using the SD card. Okay. Now in Premiere, the obvious way to do this is to click File. And then, uh, I'm not in Premiere. File. Import. Okay, or Command I is the shortcut. And then I go find my SD card, which is right here. And it's the clips are going to be in here. No, that's not true. They're going to be, I think, under private. Nope. Well, they are in here, but no, those are just pictures. Where are they? Found them. Okay, the MP root folder in our case. Find the folder that they're in. There'll be a video file of some kind. Ours are MP4s. Yours will probably be MP4s. They may be MOVs or some other video file. You can tell if they're a video file because it'll be a playable video. And these are all the clips that are on her SD card. Okay, but we just want to import the ones that are for her 24-hour challenge. Okay, now... The obvious answer would be to just click import and you could do that and you could start editing. Now I don't recommend you do that though because if you do that and then they're going to reference the video clips from your SD card and then if you're ever editing and the SD card's not in the computer then you're not going to have the clips and you're going to have a problem. So what I recommend you do before you do this is you go to finder If you're editing on a Mac, if you're editing on a PC, it'll be different, but you can do something similar to this. You go to Finder, and you have two Finder windows open, okay? Here's how you get two Finder windows open. Finder, File, New Finder window, okay? And we want two of them open, because we're going to drag and drop the clips from one to a designated folder on the other. And this is important that you stay organized. So right here, we're going to stay organized. I like to keep mine in my Documents folder, okay? And I like to make a new folder for the project. We're going to call this 24 hour challenge. Okay. Open up that folder. This is where we're going to keep all our media, all our content, anything we need for the 24 hour challenge video. All right. Then in this finder window, we're going to go find the SD card, which happens to be this right here. We're going to locate. We're going to locate the. We're going to locate the um, videos, and we need to find the videos that we need. Okay, so they're somewhere towards the bottom. I happen to know. There. This is part of it. No, go up. Yeah. Okay, so this is the first twenty-four hour challenge video. So I'm going to import that one. But I'm just going to mark it in a color so I know. So that's the last one. Let's go find the first one. No. Okay. You do not need to import that THM file. I don't even know what that is. It's something that the camera makes, but you don't need to import that for editing. So, is this still 24 hour challenge? There. That's the start of the 24 hour challenge? Okay, so that's our first one. So we'll mark that one. Okay, so from red to red, we're going to import. Now, to select multiple clips, at the top, all we're going to do is drag and drop them over here. Okay, like we could go like that and drag and drop. And it will copy it onto our computer so that when we edit, it's referring to it on our computer instead of the SD card. That way, if the SD card is not in our computer later on, we um, can still edit. Does that make sense? Lenny? Yeah. Okay. So now... To save time, we're going to select them all at once. So you select the first one. You hold Command, or if you're on a PC, you hold Control. You hold, and by the way, Premiere works the same on PCs and Macs, with just slight differences. One slight difference being that you use Control instead of Command. So hold Command or Control if you're on a PC, and click on each clip that we are going to import.
some of them um are outtakes because um I um film some stuff back. That's fine. That's what that's what we're doing. That's what is called editing. Okay. Yep. All right. So now we bring these along. All right. We've got all the clips for the twenty-four hour challenge. We drag them, drop them, and they will automatically copy over in less than a minute to our computer. Four gigs. All right. Once they're copied over to our pro computer, then we import them into Premiere. All right. And while it's doing that, I'll show you two ways to import. You can click File, Import, and go to Documents, find the folder that you put them in, and you can select by clicking the first one and holding Shift and selecting the last one. It will select all of them, and then click Import. You can import them that way. That's going to that's going to import them into the computer or into Premiere. All right. The other way that I do a lot is I just go to my Finder window. Got to wait for it to finish copying them over before I can import the last few. There. Okay, I need to see which, I'm sorry, I'm just checking which clip was the last one. I think it was 74. Okay. So now I need to find 74 I already imported, so I click on 75, scroll to the bottom, grab the last one, and I can just click from the finder, drag these directly into Premiere, and it will do the same thing. It will import them into my Premiere project. Okay, so that is how you import your clips into <coughs> Premiere. You are now ready to start editing your video. Um, you've got your project set up, you've got your clips imported. They're not only imported into Premiere, but they're also on your computer if you followed this video. If you imported them straight into Premiere, I suggest you rewatch this video and you import them to your computer first and then into Premiere because you will have problems when you go to bring them into a, or when you go to edit if you've taken the SD card out, okay? Last important thing, always, always, always save, save, save frequently. Premiere auto saves, but not every second. So I want to push Command S. That's my shortcut for save, and it just saved my project. Command S is the shortcut to save. Do that often, or Control S if you're on a PC, and go File, Save. That's another way to do it. That's the slow way. Okay, Command S. You want to get used to doing things the fast way. All right, that's it for how to import your clips into Premiere. In the next clip, we in the next video, we will show you how to edit your um, rough cut. That's the first version of your video. We're going to edit the rough cut. That's what we're going to do next. So join us on the next video.